back everybody so strolling down wolf avenue oh there's like a bee come on a bee stuck there come on uh, sometimes the AI on these guys is not the best so where was oh yeah we are going to work on towers today I've got some uh, tough bricks and stuff because I got new bricks. I'm going to play with them. So I'm going to put in a tower here. So this will be one tower right here. And then the other tower will be over there in that corner. So I think... Yeah, I think that'll be good. And then I'm actually going to do this. Because I like the texture on the top of that for a floor. Did he? He just vanished. Interesting. I, was gonna go, I wasn't sure what he was up to. And he just sort of disappeared on me. There. So those be the top. Boy, that does look sturdy. I mean, it's so thick compared to these bricks. Really thick and sturdy. I like that. So that's going to be the first floor. Let's see. I do windows off the back and windows off the side. I don't want anything here yet. The windows in the front are going to be in the second story and they're going to be like shoot, shooter holes, murder holes, I guess. I don't know what those are called. Little arrow holes so they can shoot arrows through. So I think this would be, that would be good for the first floor. Yes. And I'm not making too big of windows on the other side, but I can make windows on these two sides here they face into the city so I am gonna put like bars on them there we go nice and sturdy so I think I don't want to block that window but I can do like this I have to get up to this floor Another solid row. Actually, not so solid. Let's leave the corners off this one. Get the corner off of this one and over here. And I have some nether brick. I want to put some color in here. this um oh i don't like that because if i got the window here where i'm shooting you don't want your stairs coming up right into that window so i think i'm gonna have to do this we're gonna have to go up this way there we go. And that gets us to the second floor. I'm not quite sure how many floors it's going to have, but it's going to be more than two because I need it tall enough 
to get a good view of everything. And then we'll go from here. Let's get we're switching up with another brick. Stone bricks. Let's see. I don't. I can't really put a window here because of the stairs. So I'm going to make a wide window there. A window here, so you can actually see out. There. I think this one we're going to use no stairs, but we will have maybe there. Yeah, actually not there. Here. Well, let me figure this out. We want ladder access, but it needs to. Let's see. Um, where is that? Oh, yeah. I'm going to have to go get some more tough. Been going wild using this stuff. Let's get the rest of the nails. And things like that. Um, where's there? Right there. I didn't bring any lights, did I? Well, for now, I'll put torches. Let's torch both of that. I don't want. I don't want to go downstairs and find a creeper just sitting there waiting for me. It goes like this. Okay. And then we that. And maybe this goes up. Goes up a little more. Let's do like that. Mm. What do I do? I dropped a, dropped a brick. Let me guess. Uh, maybe, yeah, maybe like two more up, I think. Let's get. Yeah, I think it's nighttime. It's hard to tell sometimes with the rain. Okay, two, four, more, two more up and then a platform with a roof on it. I think that'll be. That'll finish us off. Yeah. yeah. Have any more? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something like that. Okay, so I need to get a little bit more flooring. And then we should be... Should be pretty good. Let's see, so I think there would be a path. Like there. 
Let's see, we'll do, I want to do like that just because it looks a little too, too flat and solid. Okay, let's see if I can get, there we go. Let's see here. Oops. There. And yeah, that looks a lot better. I'm going to hang a lantern from the center of each like that. There, and I think that just looks better with like a little lead way into there. That window just looks off. See, oh, I need to furnish this. So I'll have to put some chests and stuff down there. Let's do. Lantern. So I got that one there. Maybe I'll do like this. Like it will pretend there's a grate that could drop down and cover the door or cover the window if I need to. But then you can actually get up here and shoot. So we got the holes here so you can shoot. And then you get up here. I do believe this. Where is uh, this here? Um, let's go up there. Can I do there? Something like that. And then I will need, uh, let's see, maybe here and here. Okay, I don't think I've got anything spawnable up here, so I think we're good. Final bit. Where's my I need some kind of covering over the top here? Of course, I marked get rid of the wrong one. And do I have? Wouldn't you know it? I've actually, I think I can. I got a crafting table down here. Oh, come on. There we go. I'm going to have to take a step back and see how this actually looks, because I don't know. I think I went back. So, so, oh! Oh! <laughs> um, yeah, maybe there. I almost dropped to the floor. There, there. Hey. 
there. And then I should be able to drop down there. Let's see, I'm going to hang some banners around here. There. And let's put, yeah, put the door there. That's good. So let's see, the first floor is pretty secure, so I think put like a couple barrels for storing things, and then we're gonna have you know, like a uh, like a table here. Where is my there it is? So we'll put like a table there. So this is kind of more like a, a ready room or a lounge area down here. Oops, and then I think I'm going to put just a couple weapons there at the ready in case they need to uh, grab them real quick and go. And we'll also put another one up here. I've got more barrels, so we're gonna. This is more of an active, an active area. So I'm gonna put in barrels, like a bow here. We'll put another bow on this wall. A couple arrows in it. It's not so much, this is more the active room where you're keeping an active eye out and stuff. You get up here, this is more protected. You still got the idea you can get up here and take a look around. So I think, oh, where'd I put it? Where am I at? There we go. Yes, over here. I left that behind accidentally. Go up here. So with this, I'm going to put in a cartographer table. Oops. Oh no. On top, and then I have a map. So we kind of got a map of the area. So this is used for scouting. So you can keep an eye on. Here's the map. Take a look. Okay. Yeah, it's over there. Is that the right direction? That is the right direction because there is the harbor and we are there. The other tower is going to go right over here where that little X is. So I think that'd be fine. Then up here, we have another lookout area. I'm going to put a couple chests here. I don't really need, I don't need the sword up here because who's going to be up here with the sword, but I can see having an extra bow up here just in case. So this is, uh, so this is the first tower. I may get something to put in that corner, maybe a bookcase or something over there. But I think we're pretty well done. You know, let's go take a look at it from this side over here. I need something on that edge right there. Um, let's see what I've got in my little boxes of tricks here. Uh, it don't seem that good there. I think I'm going to do... Holy cow, I've got a lot of stuff. Lots of stuff, in, I think. So that's not going to work. Oh, maybe I should get some andesite. Now, I don't know if you can see, but this ledge up here just doesn't look good. Something about it missing something and I think that's something 
is like a little edging to go around it here. There. Let's go take a look at that. Yeah, that works much better. It just it just was too something about it just didn't look right. I think that that'll go good for a tower, and it does fit in with the rest of the stuff around here, so it's not too uh, flamboyant or standing out. So I guess one last thing I need to do before we're done today is take this and put it over there. There we are, finished with the second tower. So I got both towers done. I think I've got it the same. I may have changed a couple things here and there because I didn't actually use a schematic. I just sort of did it by eyeballing it. So I kind of eyeballed and put the bricks down, eyeballed, put the bricks down. So, but which I guess things aren't completely identical in real life. So this is as close to real life as you can get. So this is a little different down here, but I got a little eating table for people, got a little bed so they can nap, they can peek out and see things. Not very strategic here. The second floor is much better, you can shoot things and see things. So I guess if you got guards in this tower and guards in that tower, uh, no way is anyone sneaking up into the city. Or at least if the guards are awake. Then up here, we got the... And this is where I did change. I think, yeah, I had andesite there and I've just got stone brick because I had stone brick in my inventory and didn't bother to go get the andesite. So, yeah, due to laziness, yes, we have andesite there. I don't remember this being, I guess, oh, there's, I forgot the little wall. There's a wall here I forgot to put in. I was thinking this was a little too wide open. That makes, okay, that makes sense. There's... I was up there trying to figure out, it's like, this seems a little too wide open. I don't know why. But now I know why. It's because I forgot to put in. Um, oh, dang it. I had it in my inventory all along. I forgot to put in the extra wall. And then I got this. It's a different spot. There, so, Because I thought it was a little too easy to be jumping up there. Although, it might. I mean, you could do this, where you've got, you can pop up, get a better view, and then jump down, so you don't have to worry about, because uh, you don't want to be exposed standing here, which is, if you don't have the wall, but you do need a little boost to get up, so you can actually see, because it does make sense to be around there. Don't really want to get all the way over because I don't think you can get back. Or maybe you can. Let's try. So if I went all the way up and over, can I get right back? Oh, you can get back out. So that might that'd be pretty good. I'll do that. I'll leave this here. So a little elevated area. What are you barking at, dog? Hold on. The neighbor was driving out of the driveway and my dog did not like it so she was barking at him i guess they didn't get the the pass or the permission 
All right, sorry about that. A little bit of a interruption there. Guess who that was? Oh, yeah, we got this last but not least up here. We have a nice lookout, and then I've added in a spyglass. I probably should put one over on that thing. But we got a spyglass so we can take a look out and see what's going on out there. As you can see everything out there. Look how far. I do like the spyglass. I, I always just sort of just play with it whenever I get it. It's like, ooh. Can see what the wolves are doing. See what the little piggies are doing. Looks like I need to go through and put some carpet and stuff. I think dark green carpet on top of those look better. Over there is fine with the moss because it kind of matches the leaves. But I need a darker color on top of the spruce. Oh, that's not. Oh, it looks like. Oh, there's. Yeah, I need to do something there too. Maybe some buttons or something. Anyhow, that is, uh, that's it for today. I want to thank you all very much for watching. I hope you're uh, having a great day, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.